Hey, what's up, social media family? Got a word that I want to share with you that I know is going to help a lot of people, give a lot of people encouragement, and, and it's going to help a lot of people move forward in a few certain areas. Recently, uh, the Lord woke me up, and as soon as he woke me up, I heard the Lord so strongly say, healed and delivered. As I leaned in and really started to pray, the Lord said, I want my people healed and delivered. So got up, started praying into it. And the first thing I thought about was healed physically. You know, God wants people healed physically, okay? And then I started thinking about deliverance. And you know when people get delivered from different things. And I just started thinking about physical and also spiritual healing and deliverance. And just really dove into the place of prayer and, and really just felt the heart of God as, as he just really was showing me his heart for his people and how he really wanted to see people to be made whole. So I jumped in and put some scriptures on it. I, I love getting a word and praying into the word and, and putting scriptures on it. Psalms 107.20, he sent his word and healed them and delivered them from their destruction. Okay, this could be talking about physical healing, um, psychological healing, mental healing. It could be anything. Whenever you're going through something, get the Word of God and put the Word on what you're going through. If you've had trauma in your life, if, if you're struggling with insecurity or fear, put the Word on it and, and watch yourself start to grow and as you're doing that, you're going to bring healing to yourself. All right. Next word, Matthew 8, 16 through 17. And when even when evening had come, they brought to him many who were demon-possessed. He cast out the spirits with a word and healed all who were sick. Every one of them. Every one of them. I love that. I want you to think about that. When Jesus spoke, not a few people got healed. Everybody got healed. Everybody who was demon-possessed were set free. Okay? And it said that it might be fulfilled, which was spoken by Isaiah the prophet, when he said, he himself took our infirmities and bore our sicknesses. You know, there's a scriptures that we can quote, and we can use that with the authority God has given us and we will see people healed and delivered. I mean, God woke me up from a good sleep to tell me that I want to see people healed and delivered. And I'm telling you, this is the heart of the Father. If anyone that you know is needs physical healing or a deliverance or it could be a, a healing from trauma or anything or any type of deliverance, these scriptures I'm sharing that go with the prophetic word, that goes with the authority that we have as believers, we're going to see a lot of people healed and set free. Psalms 34, 17, when the righteous cry for help, the Lord hears and delivers them out of all of their trouble. Not 70%, 80%, 90%, all of their trouble. Psalms 107, 6, then they cried to the Lord in their trouble, and he delivered them from their distress. You cry out when you're in trouble, when, when, when you're stressed out, when you're in distress, when you're going through calamity. God hears. Holy Spirit speaks to you. Prophesy life. Declarations and decrees. Prophesy them. And put the word of God on it. And watch how things change. Psalms 50, 15. And call upon me in the day of trouble, and I will deliver you. Pretty simple. Pretty simple right there. Luke 10, 19. Oh, this is one of my favorite scriptures in all the Bible. Behold, I have given you authority to tread on serpents and scorpions and over all of the power of the enemy, and nothing shall hurt you. You got divine power over everything that tries to come and plague itself against you. 2 Timothy 4.18, The Lord will rescue me from every evil deed and bring me safely into his heavenly kingdom. To him be the glory forever and ever.
Friends, I'm telling you, we want to be healed, set free, delivered. But I want to let you know today, our Heavenly Father wants us to be healed, set free, and delivered more than we want to be healed, set free, and delivered. Because we need to manifest the glory. We need to manifest the kingdom realm. And the more that we are healed, the more that he can use us. Okay? He knows the importance. Number one, he loves us. He wants us set free. But two, he knows when we're set free, we can go out and do more for the kingdom of God. So I declare over you today, I declare over you healing. I declare over you in the name of Jesus, deliverance from all hindering spirits. Hey, if you need prayer, go to the website, jojodawson.net. Go to the contact button. There's a place for prayer. Send me a prayer request. I'd love to pray for you.